Good morning. Welcome to another day of AMI for Tuesday. We're getting closer. We've got nine days of school left. All right, we've got our jokes to start our day today. How does Darth Vader like his toast? On the, On the dark side. How do celebrities stay cool? They have lots of fans. What did the fisherman say to the magician? Pick a cod, any cod. All right, and these are from our very own Isaac Polmeyer. What's the best thing about Switzerland? I don't know, but the flag is a big plus. How does Moses make his coffee? He brews it. And the last one. And the Lord said unto John, Come forth, and you will receive eternal life. John came fifth and won a toaster. Those are Isaac's jokes for us today. All right, let's get started with our morning prayer. Good morning. Good morning. Jesus wants all, all people to live happy and healthy lives. He tells us how to make that happen. The, the word love is mentioned six times in today's reading. The word um, abide means to stay or remain in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone. The stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His steadfast love endures forever. Let Israel say, his steadfast love endures forever. Let those who fear the Lord say, his steadfast love, love endures forever. The stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone.
Please give us the grace we need. We ask this in the name of our risen Lord, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Can you please say the Pledge of Allegiance with me? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I will try my best every day to learn to love others and to act like Jesus. All right, our feast day today is the feast of Saint Candida Maria. That is the name she took when she joined her religious order, and it means Mary Immaculate, in honor of Jesus' mother. She was born in Spain in 1845. She was the oldest of seven children, and her family made their living weaving cloth. When she was 18, she left the family home to earn money as a maid. However, it was not long before she felt God was calling her to religious life. She started a new religious order that was dedicated to helping neglected women and children in Spain. She helped these people with their problems and taught them about Jesus, and she died in the year 1912. She was just made a saint just a few years ago, so just a, uh, it's a modern day saint, so it is still a church, reminds us of our church being alive and things growing, um, that new saints come around for us all the time. Um, and that maybe someday some of you, some of our St. Joseph students could become saints. Right? All we have to do is follow God's will for our lives. And so we pray today, St. Joseph, pray for us. And St. Candida Maria, pray for us. We've got no birthdays again to call today. And we again pray for the Cox family, the Panic family, the Cawthorn family, the Heinz family, and the Tarvin family. And we've got one more student who's completed an Alex Pi. So congratulations to Elsie Stiggy in Miss Mauer's class. She has completed her Alex Pi. Um, so great job, Elsie. Uh, great job, anybody else who's really close. We hope we get to call your name here before school is out in the last two weeks. All right. Well, thanks for another day of AMI. We'll see you again tomorrow. Bye.